if you've been playing for a number of years and you're looking for lots of piano pieces to set, read or play, then this video is for you. Hi guys, this is Mandy from Piano Sight Reading, where I give sight reading tips to pianists. If you're new here, then make sure you subscribe and hit the bell so that you see more videos like this. In my previous video, I talked about a sight reading book series that I recommend for piano beginners. If you haven't seen that already, then I suggest you watch that at the end of this video. I'll have it in the cards. In this video, I'll be talking about another book series, but this one is not specifically for sight reading. But it's a book series that I talk about a lot and that I mention all the time. It's called the Essential Keyboard Repertoire series. I mention it a lot because I use it myself for sight reading and I really like the kind of pieces that they have. It's a series of eight volumes and the volumes contain roughly 75 to 100 pieces. The level of difficulty goes from early intermediate to around late intermediate. So it's perfect if you've played piano for a few years and you want to find lots of pieces to set, read or play. And the pieces are from different musical genres, so you'll have Baroque, Classical, Romantic and Modern pieces. And some of the volumes focus on certain kinds of pieces. For example, Volume 3 contains sonatinas. Volume 5 is for a handspan of one octave or less. So if you have small hands, then this volume is for you. And Volume 8, which is the one that I have, it contains miniatures. What I like about this series is that it contains pieces from well-known composers, but also lesser-known composers. For example, in this volume that I have, volume 8, you have pieces by Bach, Bartok, Beethoven, Handel, Scarlatti, Chopin, etc. But you also have a lot of pieces by composers that are not as well known. I won't try to pronounce the names because sometimes they're a bit difficult to pronounce. And as you see, the pieces are arranged by level. So you've got early intermediate and then intermediate and then late intermediate. So this means you could go through the book starting from the beginning and just making your way through and you could side read one or two pieces a day. Let me now play you a few samples from the book. So this one is from the early intermediate section and it's the Baroque. something from the classical period. This is still in the early intermediate level. from the intermediate section uh, and in the romantic style it's by Chopin Lastly, let me play you one of the modern pieces from the late intermediate section.
So as you can see, there's a nice mix of pieces. There are some that are well known and some lesser known and you have a variety of genres. Some of these volumes come in the Kindle edition, so you can do what I do and use the iPad to view the score. But beware that not all the volumes are available in Kindle edition. And some of the volumes also come with a CD. Again, check whether they do come or whether you have to buy separately. I've put the links of all the books in the description below. So check them out and please let me know in the comments what you think of these books, whether you've used them or not. I hope this video has been useful. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Happy set reading!